Well, the team started excavating Kalao Cave in the early 2000s, and in 2007, um, they found a small football. At that time, I got involved in the dating of that football, and we ran it um, through uranium series dating, so the technique that they um, use, and we published that that football is 63,000 years old. It was either juvenile or of a very small human species, but you, just from one bone, you can't know much more. This is the oldest Philippine human remain ever found, because before that the oldest were perhaps 30,000 years old or so. They continued the excavations at Kalao Cave and in 2011 and 2015 they found more material. So they sent me samples from the new excavations and so I worked on a human tooth. We decided to use uranium series dating. Unfortunately, it only gives you minimum age estimates. So the bone could be quite a bit older than that age, but it could also be very close to that age and uh, could establish that that age of the human tooth is 50,000 years. Well, human species are found uh, quite rarely. However, in the early 2000s, Homo floresiensis was excavated in Flores. We know it's about also 60,000 years. And it basically says when modern humans arrived in Southeast Asia, there were other humans around, but probably quite a bit more than we thought. In Indonesia and the Philippines, the systematic investigations start only in the last 20, 30 years or so. Virtually most of Southeast Asia is unexplored. I would expect that if we continue with systematic investigation and excavations, it's very likely that we find more human remains, and some may be as exciting as Homo floresiensis or Homo lusonensis.